Wilbraham police officer Cameron Prosperi continues his long recovery from his from his serious injuries after being shot in the line of duty back in January. 22 News reporter Heath Kalb is live in studio with how his local community have come together to support him. That's right, Christina. It was Saturday, January 20th, when police officer Cameron Prosperi sustained a gunshot wound on the job. Since then, he's been making progress, and today, hundreds of people made sure he has one less worry. As Cameron Prosperi continues his long recovery from his serious injuries at home in the Three Rivers section of Palmer, just down the road, many of his friends, family, and those that he had worked to protect made sure he doesn't need to worry about money during his fight back. To know that uh, you know his future is uh, a little bit more secure because we're still not uh, not sure of uh, the outcome in in the future, really. So hundreds gathered at this fundraiser called Pasta for a Purpose, where all the proceeds from the 50/50, the raffle items, and the food are going directly to Cameron. I mean, we couldn't do this without the support of the community, and neither can the businesses. So it's just great to see everybody coming out to support Cam. And even though Cameron didn't get to be here today, his parents tell me that all of this support will not only be financially life changing. It's lifting his spirits in a time where he needs it. Uh, it's so great to see the community that he lives in and works so closely to, uh, you know, come out and support him. And they have been since uh, since the occurrence. So it's uh, it's just been outstanding, and we're we're very appreciated. It's just been overwhelming, really. It's been really good, and it makes Karen's attitude so much better too. Cameron's parents also telling me today that there will be another fundraiser next Saturday, and hopefully Cameron will be able to make it there next Saturday. Working for you in studio, I'm Heath Kalb, 22 News.